Black is RTTV. Gang, what gang, up? Gang. And if it's your first time here, definitely won't be your last. Make sure you kill, murder, and smash. smash. Shh. That okay. subscribe button. He said, I, I, th- I thought of you. I need one full motion. Arcane. Um, but we are back with another episode of Arcane League of Legends. Guys, we are officially at the final stretch. Last three episodes of really? what is yeah. a great oh, season. Last, yeah. yeah. This is the these, whole are last season. Three, these are the last three episodes. Yep. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's why it says watch all of season <laughs> one now. Yeah. So now it's officially, it's officially, we are at the final stretch of Arcane League of Legends. We ended episode six with Vi finally seeing Powder or what we know her as now as Jinx. Mm. And she came with Caitlyn to find Jinx. And Jinx went crazy and got jealous. She's like, oh, this is your new partner. This is your new right hand. Oh, my gosh. You guys are just after this blue ball. And Vi was like, I don't even know what that is. Is But then it looks like the Rebels, if that's what they call them, I believe they call them the Rebels, they came through to kind of get revenge on Jinx because Jinx bodied a lot of their people in the earlier episodes and also to get the Hex Tech from Jinx. But as a result... They ended up kidnapping Vi and Caitlyn. They got Caitlyn too. Yeah, they got Caitlyn too. You didn't oh, I notice it? Got Vi. No, you didn't notice it. Like they, um, they threw like an explosion, and then Caitlyn just disappeared. So they have Caitlyn too. It was Vi. Vi ended there by herself with the chopper, and she was like, "Ah!" And the episode ended. Okay. You mean, you mean powder? I mean, I mean yeah, Jinx, not powder. I mean Jinx. 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 Vi got kidnapped too. So, yeah. Yeah. yeah two for one. So now let's get into this next episode of League of Legends, Arcane, Season 1, Episode 7, The Boy Savior. Yeah. Yeah, it's so to go. <laughs> this thing is stupid. <laughs> I like the old intro better than this shit. <laughs> so you start off the show with Pusha T? Fuck up. Tell me I don't, me how I like the old I don't think this is an intro, though. That was it, man. This might just be like. A new show? Nah, Nigga, this just like be like, on League of Legends. Don't hate. I'm, at, I'm not. I'm asking you. Is this this shit fire, nigga. Is better than the other one? No, it's not better than the But I don't think this is a new intro because this is just showing. I think it's showing the boys. Yeah. That's what I thought. Yeah. Yeah. That's what you thought. Tell the truth. What if it's Little Man? (coughs) Oh, it might be Little Man. You're right. It's definitely Little Man. Oh, that's a cool little trench. Nah, that's... That is Little Man. Yay! Times has changed. Yeah, times are different now, bro. That is his voice. I'm getting that. Yeah, I'm getting that. Are you You've grown up so much. Missed you, little man. Oh, I just know she took her shackles yeah. off. Ah, <laughs> oh, this Damn. is a moment. Yeah. Damn. They yes. haven't got this moment. That's why. Yeah, you're right. Oh, the sh- shimmer. The the sacrifices we make for progress. Mm. It's why I part ways with Heimendinger. Mm. Oh, he's his partner. Oh, wow. wow. He used to be with Heimendinger. Dude. Perhaps. Well, that's probably why I forgot Heimendinger is separated from him. He's like, yeah. oh, you making a shimmer shit? I can't rock with you, my boy. I wonder if Heimendinger even knows he's alive. <laughs> nah, he, de- he definitely does it. Hmm. Yeah, who said that Jinx is not a bill shit? Yeah, he's <laughs> one of the genius. No more red team. You can bring the hex tech to the masses just like you've always dreamed. She's in your head, bro. Oh, yeah. And I could dream First and get to my money. Try not to lose your nuts. I thought I was going to give you that. 
Bro, that nigga's gonna go mad, I tell ya, mad. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who's gonna go mad first, him or Victor, because Victor's about to take that sherm. I mean, that shimmer. Sherm. You about to be sherm. You about to be a shimhead. <laughs> I killed him. Okay. Oh. Oh yeah, remember Jinx is mad at him because yeah. he lied. Yeah. Exactly. And if you're like her father, she's eventually gonna come back. It's hilarious because when she was tied up in his in his office, I dead ass thought she was dead. Yeah, yeah I thought she was dead too. That's why I'm like, yo, she's not dead yet. <laughs> Damn, she, she she's hurt herself. Maybe because she got nah, she, oh. she's uh, stapling, oh, stapling herself. Her. Yeah, okay. She's wild. Yeah, I prefer staples over stitches, though. I'm not gonna lie. Now, when I went to the hospital, I never like, got either or so I did both. That's what I'm saying. Like, Staples is way better than Stitches. Wow. I love her character. Yeah. I love, yeah, her, I love her. Yeah, her maniac episodes <laughs> be crazy. So fire. Yeah, she's the best one. Little man. Big man. Big man. I think it's probably like, what, 14 yeah. now? And they got a growth spurt. What they codename kids next door? I <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I tried, yo. I got one more thing to show you. No, he's about to show us some shit. This is what Jenks did. This is what she did. Oh wow, that's a beautiful memento. OTF, only the family. Nah, oh, yeah, they're wiling out. Remember, they're searching everybody, right? Yeah. The border. They closed the border and shit. What are you doing? You didn't tell me he was going to shut the shit down. <laughs> <laughs> like, what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, what do you mean they're dangerous? dangerous. <laughs> Why are you lying? Well, actually, he did say that, though. And then after, he said, well, we could add a variant to nature. <laughs> and that seems fucked up because all those people were trying to get through and Counselor came in and just got his boy through. Yeah, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, all right. I don't think you can come through, bro. <laughs> nah, it's crazy because that <laughs> he's like, yo, man, I can't rock with other city people. They're dangerous. Nigga, I'm from there. What do you mean, bro? <laughs> Not you. Oh, not you. you good. You good. <laughs> you a good nigga. Come on. Come on. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. He's dead. He might use whatever's <laughs> in the box on him. <laughs> he doesn't even need a mask. Go what you think, nigga. We'll pile on. <laughs> oh, he's about to kill all them? <laughs> nah, he's passing him a mask. He's gonna get to him last second. Oh, nah. <laughs> nah, he's the nah. one talking shit. He might let him die. There you go. <laughs> nah, that was G. That was G. That was G. The fact that he let him live was just like, yo, just remember who runs this shit. Look at that. This shit stopped spinning. <laughs> oh, I get why it stops um, spinning, though. Damn. Exactly. <laughs> Yeah, she had a feeling because she was hesitant at the table to even vote mm -hmm. Heimendinger off the this council. Like. What is Jace 2 um, not ready for? I mean, oh, I thought she was referring to be on the council. Like the way he's been like maneuvering and shit like that. That's what caused this uproar and shit. But it could be more. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no. 
Yo, she dipped on some bad man shit. Yeah, <laughs> she really be dip set, bro. <laughs> she gonna get that weapon complete. She gonna fuck shit up. Oh uh, yeah, cause I ain't gonna lie, Soko has been. I don't know. He he does. I don't. Know, I'm not gonna say he treats her right, but I don't know. He's he's somebody to her. I'll tell you that. <laughs> Fuck that shit, Caitlyn. Yeah, she would've definitely been in a spot with that. <laughs> yeah, 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 hey, you got that. Yeah, I was gonna say, she really don't have no pull, but Jace is on the council. Mm-hmm. But he's losing his mind, so yeah, I don't know. So that's yeah. not even gonna work in, a, in, his, in her favor. She's gonna be like, you wanna work with the Undercity? Whoa, no, we're not infiltrating the Undercity. We... Oh. Oh. And that's what Hyman Dingo was afraid of. Yep, weaponizing it. We have the numbers to defend ourselves. We agreed Hextech was controlled by some type of cave gem. We do not have a choice. Oh! Throw it! Throw it! Alright, cool. Your boy got patience, bro. Nigga, she about to blow that bitch up. Oh no, he's about to do some crack. Yeah. Oh, so don't don't get bagged. You're about to get bagged. Okay, oh, no. forget it. It's like he sealed his leg up to inject it. You seen that? <laughs> I, uh, oh. Oh. So then now. Possibly the hex tech could be compatible. Oh shit, throw it in there. Throw it in there. ASAP. Oh. Oh, is it healing him? He's oh, gonna no. fix I, him. I they thought it him in there. He's gonna forego like some transformation. Wow, he has like hex genes. You now. seen that? Yeah. yeah, it was like his actual like bloodstream turned into a hex tech. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh damn, Jinx is like. Oh damn. Shut up. <laughs> oh, that's not gonna help you right now. Oh, cause that's Marcus's bitch oh. ass. Oh. And Marcus is working with Silco. Silco threatened his daughter. Oh! Oh, oh is he dead? He, he definitely clapped him. I'll tell you that. Oh Yo, my god, they, they did body little man? Dude, you can't shoot Caitlyn, relax Marcus bro. This is a beer. Oh, the, the mechanic ones. Oh! oh! Wait, 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 you're telling me Jinx did that? Jinx made all these nah, fire that lights? Was, nah, that was smart. Look at that, Jinx look at that. Didn't make those. Wow, Jinx is a G. <laughs> Step in that bitch! Hop in that! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I didn't want to say Marcus that. is dead, though. Oh, he's, yeah, he's Bye, dead. Bye, bitch. Dead. <laughs> no final words for your dumb ass. Get Marcus, f- Marcus out of here, yo. She's like, you chose your side. Oh, yo, she that really hates late. her. Oh! oh! Wildin'. Yeah, she wildin', wildin'. Oh, little oh, man! Let's go, little yeah, man. big man! Yeah. Hey. Oh. Hey. hey, spin the block! So hey, crazy. black man, let's go! Spin the, let's oh. go! Oh. Took it back let's too. Go. Oh, what's about to happen? That was fire. They turned that into a beat. <laughs> Nah, this is about to go crazy. <laughs> <laughs> this is fire. The kids. He's not dead, bro. He's not dead. He's too lit. Oh, this is fire. From paintballs to real guns. Yeah, right. They evolved from uh, playing around in the streets to actually. Oh, oh that was hell? dope. Oh, that was fire. Right back. That was dope. Oh, oh let's clap. go. Oh, oh shit. Let's go. Oh, let's bitch. Go. Oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa. You gonna kill both of us? 
I don't think she died though. You know how quick she is, so she probably rolled off the bridge before it blew up. Nah. But he was on top of her. Yeah, like you think I'm gonna let you get away and I'm not getting away? (laughs) Bitch, we're both dying. You got me severely. Oh, wait, is she up. really dead? I mean, there's no way. She's severely injured. It's that like was, Flavor Flav. That, that, that was Little Man's Clock. That was Little Man's Clock. clock. It's like he saw into the future. You saw that? Like that's why he was able to dodge everything she did. Yeah. I don't, that was just weird. Nah, but that was that, her previous moves, yo. That I, that that, that, sequ- that fight sequence was fire. Like the fire. beginning of it. Like the way they did that. I've never seen something like that. The way they did the animation where they were going back and forth. Where they were kids and how they just changed the whole tint and changed the whole motion and then it just goes back to regular time with the clock where he just predicts all her moves and just beat the shit out of her. <laughs> he beat the <laughs> shit out of her. Bro. He beat the yeah, shit out of her, bro. That was cool though. I was like, damn, like that first animation was to reflect the fact like this is how we were as kids and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Then we ran it back. This is real time right now. I'm whooping your ass now. Like <laughs> time has changed. We ain't playing around no more. We actually been with some real shit. I don't think he's dead though. I feel he's like he's it. too little of a character to die. Like, I feel like he, the emphasis they put on him on this episode and like on his glow up too. I feel like he must he has to be like a, a player to pick from in League of Legends too. I feel you. So, which that. is why I don't think he's dead. They made him look like a martyr though. I'm not gonna, even with the title, a boy, the boy savior and stuff like that. Like he saved the day right there. So it made Damn. it seem like he's a martyr. But it couldn't. But at the end of the day, you're right. For how good of a character he is, I don't think they'll put that to waste. I know he is a great character, but like in a lot of moments in shows when you see the hero protecting one of the main characters, which is Vi, and telling them to escape in the manner that he did where he was like, go. And he was just like, all right, I'm going to shoot the fair one. Typically, that character, something bad ends up happening to that character and that character typically dies, which is why I think I think he's probably dead. I don't want him to be dead because his presentation, the presentation of him of Echo as an adult was amazing. Like, we saw him in the beginning. We didn't know it was him, right? I did. And, um, no, you didn't. I did. Wait, but, when we um, first seen him? Yeah, when we first, yeah. first seen him, when they were yeah. on the ship, when he had the mask on. Oh, oh no, no, I yeah. tell you something on this episode. I'm like, no, nigga, no, I ain't no, 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 big no, man. No, when we first, when yeah. we actually, the first time we saw him, we didn't know who the person behind the mask was. I don't even think we questioned who the person behind the mask was. Yeah. We didn't even question that it was Little Man or anybody at that point. For and then for the presentation that they gave for him today, like and then the way they did the animation, if he's died, if he's dead, it wouldn't be far fetched to me. Nah, bro, if they kill him like that and fucking Jinx is alive, this is some bullshit. Yeah, nigga, <laughs> how? How? He got armor on. She don't got no armor on. But a bomb blows up and I die. Unless he did this. Nah, he. Yo, know, I, I honestly don't agree with both of them. I think he is alive, and I think based on shows that that is not true. Because even in Baruto, when um. Remember the dude's uncle? Thank he's you. He's like, go away. Remember, he's like, go, go, and he survives. He survives. <laughs> when the characters, live, they actually survive when they do that. It's, they make it seem like they almost die, and out of nowhere, miraculously, they're alive. And saving doesn't dying. mean that you're a martyr. Saving just means you're saving people. It has nothing to do like you have to give up your life. So the title yeah. doesn't no, mean that. A lot of times, the martyrs are killed. No, Savior people. doesn't. I'm saying Savior doesn't Oh, oh okay. Ah, That's yeah, why you yeah, said yeah, the yeah. title. The title doesn't mean that he's just the boy Savior. Savior has nothing to do with a martyr. Savior just means you're saving people's lives. That's it. So those two statements, I don't think because of those two facts that I brought up, I definitely don't think he's alive. Because I definitely yeah, think the you way say they do am- think he's alive. Yeah, yeah I definitely yeah. think just based on the way the show built him up, the budget they put behind him, and they didn't even give like if he was gonna die, I don't think it would have been that way. Where you see the clock ticking, and like I feel like he probably is messed up, rock, but. I definitely think the budget and thing like he he's a character that could help this franchise go far, and I think I don't think they'll emphasize all this on him, and then boom, he's not he's dying gone. off screen, nigga. Yeah, that's that's the shit too. It's yeah. like you thought you was just gonna kill me with a clock, bitch. Nah, nah, nah. You, you better show my damn face. You gotta that show his face where he's like, Geez. yo, you got you keep but forgetting that. I never thought that wasn't her clock. That was his clock. Well, and, well, that was his clock going out or whatever. Like I'm saying, like you're not gonna uh, kill me on some symbolism shit. You know what's crazy? That's that's funny you bring up the clock shit because that could be like foreshadowing his time being up too. Yeah, because that's, that's why that's what I took it as like that might be it. But it's like, bro, no, don't kill me like that. Yeah, yeah, like I expected him to have like at least like a last like thing with pop, with Jinx. Like you don't remember when we were kids. Like he just had this whole thing about them being kids playing paintballs and shit. 
Like, at least give my mans, like, a, let him get his last words off. You know what I'm saying? Don't just clock me out, though. Like, it's a fucking shift at McDonald's or some shit. This is some he bullshit, said, yo. Clock don't like clock it. me out, nigga. He <laughs> said, bullshit. Don't clock me out like it's a shit for McDonald's. That's a lot. Marcus is going to get last words and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My boy Marcus. Nah, my boy Marcus, if they let him get his last words, tell my dog. Nigga die, man. Soup he dead. Yeah, I get think, Marcus out of here. I think um I don't think he's dead, but that could one that could allude to him being dead or just the fact that like that clock symbolized their flashback and him seeing her as powder still. And I maybe the fact that that clock stopped means like yo, I can no longer see her. Um, you know what I'm saying? As powder, because that's what ultimately made me take this L when taking this bomb. You know what I'm saying? Because I had to stop because I saw powder. So now that. She, although I saw her like that, and she knew I stopped because of that reason, and still tried to kill me. Is that time was over? Yeah, one thing I agree with is he's definitely a character. He got to be a character in League of Legends because yo, the way he was fighting with that that skateboard shit when he pulled up and got the the hex tech back. Yeah. Nah, that was probably one of the dopest scenes, bro. My yeah. boy, my boy came up, skr skr, bow. I'm like, yo, this nigga did some whole Tony Hawk shit. Shit was too fire, man. Nah, um. I definitely, you actually made a good point about the clock. Like, the clock gives me, makes me think even more that he died. Like, to let it know that his time was up. And even so, like, at the end of the fight, and even, like, at the end of the fight, when he stopped, because he was, he was beating the shit out of Jinx. Like, he had her on the ropes. And I think that's the first, like, one-on-one L that we've seen her take as Jinx. Like, that's the first time we actually seen her get her ass whooped as Jinx, right? So I think because of the look that they gave each other and he even I think he even felt like, yo, you're the way she looked at him was like, hey, you're so my friend because she smiled a little bit, but she did something to deceive and did the bomb and threw the bomb. That's the only reason why I think he could be dead. But another thing I want to point out, too, is, yo, the score that they did during that fight was amazing. Mm -hmm. Like the score that they did, it, it fit everything. It fit the aesthetic perfectly. It fit everything perfectly. Um, Thank you. That Marcus is dead. Get him out of here. His bitch ass. Thank you. Um, and I think that like everything they did with this episode just messed really, really well. And we're also another thing too, we're also starting to see Jace become the villain little by little. And Mel is just feeding the beast and feeding it. And she's getting to a point where she's like, hey, now you have to create weapons to to, to defeat the undercity. So now there's gonna be chaos and it's just gonna be an all-out war. I have hope for Jace, yo. I feel like there's going to be a moment where he's going to know that, like, damn, I might have gone too far. Like, it might be the moment where he creates, like, he weaponizes the first hex tag and stuff like that. And, like, a certain, like, a collateral type of death occurs. And he's like, damn, yo, I went too far and realized that um, the girl that was the girl that. Um, Cupcake? The, huh? Yeah, you come off no, 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 no. The one that's on the console room, the one that he's messing no. with. Yeah, no. I feel like he's going to notice that, like, yo, this girl been manipulating me this whole time and stuff. Once that weapon goes so far and kills somebody that he actually cares about, whether it's Caitlyn, whether it's his mother, something like that. But I think it's going to be a point of time where he's going to be like, yeah, I've gone too far with this um, hex tech. Which is why I think he's, he's going to go crazy because mm-hmm. I feel like his rise to power or rise to the council um, wasn't really based on him. It was really more people trying to influence him to get there because they wanted to use what he had. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So, like, once he realized that that, that was a plan the whole time, it's going to be too late and he's going to lose his mind. Mm. Yeah, I think I, yeah, another thing, too, this could be another twist to where, like, kind of like in Tokyo Revengers, where um, somebody ends up dying and he just blames it on the Undercity. And he's just like, well, and Mel will probably continue to get into his head and be like, well, this wouldn't have happened. We wouldn't have had to come to this if the Undercity just knew how to act. At the point, so which would make him, and I think he'll still go crazy too as a result of that. So, and I do agree, I think he's gonna kill somebody, he's gonna kill somebody that he loves, whether it be Caitlyn, whether it be Heimendinger, it might be Heimendinger. Heimendinger might get now, Herman, Heimendinger is the savior, I think. He's currently in the other city doing some shit. Yeah, he got the hoodie on, he's yeah. like vigilante Heimendinger. Yeah. <laughs> hoodie season, boy, yeah. real shit. But nah, if Heimendinger dies, I don't think it would be far fetched, though. Nah, he's not gonna die. Because like, I wouldn't be surprised if he sacrifices himself. On some yeah, that's him. what I'm saying. I, but I don't think I don't think he'll get killed, but I think he might like sacrifice. Cause like, at this point, yo, it's that pussy power, bro. Like she really got this nigga doing whatever she wants, and it's just like, bro, Jace, you don't see this shit. You don't see this shit, bro. Yo, you want to make bombs, yo? We gotta have bombs. Yo, I would have looked at Vic- Victor. Looked at him like I feel like Victor knows at this point like. She got your stupid ass. All right, bro. Whatever. Like, mm-hmm. so you want to go fight these niggas? This what you want to do? We didn't create it for this. 
But man, what are we gonna do, man? We gotta be ready. This bitch. I'm waiting for Victor to be like, you really gonna keep listening to this bitch, yo? I'm sick of this shit. I'm sick of this bitch, yo. <laughs> nigga, I'm ready to see what happened with Victor, my nigga. Yeah. <laughs> you feel yeah. me? That nigga just injected himself with that shimmery and shit. Hextech just became infused with his DNA. So I, I wonder if he created the stabilization that was needed for his shimmer. Cause we see how niggas always go butt wild when it could, like the shimmer gets injected in them. So I wonder if that was what the shimmer needed was that hex tech and what was gonna ha- what's gonna happen with him is it, is it gonna become an enhanced human but still remain like the same appearance uh-huh. i think he's gonna get i think he's gonna get buck and get gully on jace and pretty much what? say that he's gonna oh, get gully buck yeah get buck and gully on jace and say exactly what you said it was either you or evan who said that he's gonna be like yo you still listen to this bitch <laughs> and then it's gonna turn into a fight and he might die who um um, what you gonna call it? Victor? Victor. Victor. How the fuck is he gonna die from Jace? Because he's mean, a weapon that he created or some shit like that? Yeah. Oh. Victor has become a superhuman. <laughs> he is not gonna die, bro. He just... You remember how they were doing experiments on those plants? Yeah. And every time they kept dying? Yep. That's why I do gave him that shimmer. He was like, yo, this helps you undergo any kind of transformation. It helps stabilize it. So, like, nigga, if that... Um, if the Hex Tech didn't kill... Um, Victor and his disease ain't kill him, nigga. He's not dying in the show. <laughs> <laughs> he's definitely not dying. <laughs> not after you. They make it successful, and then he get yeah, killed right yeah, after. Yeah, yeah. Shit. Nigga, I'm saying too many people are gonna die. Uh, this nigga Soko, <laughs> this nigga Soko really treated the uh, the bottom like fucking crack in the '80s, nigga. <laughs> yo, flood the streets of this shit, nigga. Yo, yo, yo you, that's what I was saying. You either get too. high, you selling this shit, my nigga. Okay, <laughs> this the block, you heard? He said, yo, we gonna put this on the block. Y'all niggas go. Echo was up. like, bro, everybody's doing shimmer. Everybody over here was doing shimmer. I had to get people up. We had to make a whole different spot. Cause either you was a victim or you was doing shimmer. You was that's all you had. I'm like, damn, yo, he violated. He's fucked up. He violated. You know what it seems like? It seems like it's either you were selling or you were using or you were on using it. Yeah. Or you were on it. And if you weren't doing either, then you were with you were with Echo in that little tree spot in the kids next door the tree house. Yeah. <laughs> this nigga said kids next door. That shit had me crying. <laughs> But just finished episode seven. We officially have two more episodes left of RK League of Legends. Yo, Thank you guys for joining lit. us on this journey. But if it's your first time here, it definitely won't be your last. Make sure you kill murder and smash, smash that subscribe button. I am the man, the myth, the maniac, Wilkins underscore RT. Make sure you guys check out that arcane playlist, that avatar playlist, and all the dope playlists on the channel. And remember, guys, it's a beautiful day to stay blessed. And not to stress. Namaste. Patrick got tea, baby. What's good, bro? It's your boy DC. It's your boy Wells. The anime king. It's your boy Rob City RT. And that settles it at the, the round, round table. table.